Hey, this is Johnny Rowlett. I'm so glad that you've decided to join us today on our YouTube page, Full-Time Freedom Tour. Today, I'm really excited to introduce to you a gentleman that as our guest on here, and uh, and he has been coming to partnered up with Gail and I on our YouTube journey and has uh, brought to us the beautiful world of tire minder and innovation tire. Um, uh, a couple of, it was kind of interesting that it was like about uh, probably six months ago, I was just minding my own business, doing my no normal YouTube uh, videos. And I, I was, uh, had this, this gentleman reached out to me and just started discussing, uh, you know, some of the things that he had seen in our videos and he was learning the RV world. His bit, he comes from a business background and he had recently decided to kind of shift in that and start traveling a lot more and and was just asking us questions about you know how to rv and uh and because you know if you do it for more than two years all of a sudden you're an expert in RVing because of all the disasters that come your way so um uh recently though i was with him i just accidentally ran across him at the tampa bay auto show and i happen to have some friends there that have a big old motorhome. As you know, Gail and I have a 2011 Winnebago Tour and a 45 foot. And my buddy had an a Integra Anthem 45 foot. And and we literally were just there exploring and looking at all the fun tools and gadgets and, and came across Michael. And he actually recognized, not me, he actually recognized my wife first. And he's like, then he turned to me and goes, are you Johnny? <laughs> so, uh, and we got into this really great conversation and uh, and it has led to some some new opportunities and uh, and just recently when all the covid hit and the frustrations that came with that happened um, he reached out to me with kind of an idea to we know that everybody is not RVing right now we are very aware that you probably either in storage or your your a lot of people are, are glamping in their front yards. Uh, I noticed even some friends of mine they're they're in their motorhomes or in their RVs in their front yard watching TV <laughs> and their house is right there, but they're still wanting to be in their RVs. And I, 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 for some reason I find that refreshing. But um, we uh, he approached me with an idea of how to kind of uh, uh, allow for a discount on some products. And, and maybe work mutually, co-mutually with some of you RVers, and he's working with me as well. And so what I thought I would do is, uh, I recently you saw that I did a video on getting a brand new uh, tire minder set, and I wanted to introduce to you the gentleman that made that happen and talk a little bit more about his product, his business, and his ideas of how it might benefit you right now as we prepare to get back to full-time traveling to freedom touring and uh and you know just realize that this this too shall pass you know so uh i want to really quickly bring on my friend mr uh michael kilburn there he is he's coming on right now there he is right there thank you so much how you doing michael how you doing johnny good to see you thank you i appreciate you joining me today uh, I, I was trying to give our a little bit of our background uh, of, of meeting you. We met beforehand on the phone, but the first time face to face was at the Tampa Bay uh, Auto. I mean, uh, Tampa Bay RV show, which was right. huge, huge. Tell wow. tell a little bit about how this you you had actually had a bunch of meetings set up to do these RV shows and and all those kinds of things for like until October. And the rug kind of got pulled out from underneath you, so you're trying to figure out how to, you know, how to how to make it through this time, right? We are. We we started on January second. My wife and I climbed in our RV. We've got a a, a, a diesel pusher, and we climbed in on January second, and we were scheduled to go. And part of that was the Tampa show. We saw I saw you at Tampa, and. We were scheduled to go all the way through basically the end of October. That's how many dates and locations all around the country 
<laughs> that we were booked for whether it was a rally, a trade show, uh, an education, a seminar, it didn't matter. We were just slam busy. We were so excited. And in the last, in the, in March, we had one week off. I was spending some time in Wisconsin in, for one week with family. And during that week, uh, COVID kicked in. Everything started getting canceled. So in the, I think it was the second and the third week of March, we lost our entire summer. It was every single thing canceled. Wow. In about seven days, we lost everything and there was nothing left. So, you know, it, it's unfortunate to plan as hard as we did to build this amazing schedule. You know better than anybody right. sure. what it's like to plan a tour. I'm, I'm new to this. You know, I, I don't know what you said, but I was watching your videos to learn how to use my own RV. <laughs> so, That's scary. That's scary. And, oh, yeah. and so we were, you know, we're new. I'm two years into this, loving every bit of it. My RV is definitely my second home. But we didn't know about a lot of things. And TireMinder, which is the product we're talking about in the company that I'm working with, I just didn't know anything about it. Wow. And once I got a chance to learn about it, the company was so cordial to me. Um, I jumped in with, you know, both feet and went to town. It was so much fun. Oh, that's awesome. But yeah, Tell in this. About, uh, before you get into that presentation, I thought it might be helpful to explain. Um, uh, you you actually were in the trucking business, the trucking side of the business and mm -hmm. and when you got out of that and started doing some personal traveling in your rv you realized that there were some benefits um of products and and even fuel and all kinds of stuff that were missing for the rv world and kind of started asking why you know and and kind of filling the need well you're right i i spent uh, years in trucking i had terminals in chicago atlanta South Carolina, um, Milwaukee. And when I stepped away from trucking, um, you know, I'll be honest, uh, I'd never paid retail for diesel in 20 years. Right. I had a fuel cart because our trucks fueled up on diesel and so did I. <laughs> and when I got my RV, I pulled up and I went, well, that's really expensive. I'll just use my fuel cart and get a <laughs> discount. Well, they don't give fuel discounts to RVs. And I thought, well, well, that's not right. We're, no. I said, we need to fix that. So, and we'll talk about that. We, we fixed that. And yeah. I learned, and I remember your video, uh, uh, it was just a cool video about how to be respectful to the truckers in a truck oh. stop. Yeah. And that one hit home to me because it seems like second nature to me. I was watching your video going, oh, that's really cool. You know, because I, I used to drive semi. I've still got my CDL. Right. You know, I started off as a truck driver. Wow. But, you know, not everybody understands that world. So right. a video like that to say, listen, don't back into a truck stop and open your slides. <laughs> you know, <laughs> that's a truck driver's bed. Let's let oh, them sleep. It is. That's their business. You know, yeah, very it's, good. It's yeah. that, that's how they make their living. We're, yeah. you know, we're traveling through, but they're taking care of the family. So that's well said. There were a lot of little things that I was able to carry over, and your videos are so crucial on that. All wow, of thank you. And even the tire minder, it's it's funny because when I first started started doing RV, you know, RVing, I I realized there were some new products out on the market that were. Uh, our TPMS, you know, tire pressure yep. monitoring system. And, and I, and I, of course, I thought they were all too expensive. So I went with some cheaper brand and it was a real heavy ended uh, piece on the end of my stem. And it actually ended up causing a lot of damage to my, my valve stems and all that kind of stuff. So, but I knew the value of the TPMS system and, and uh, I have always actually wanted to work with and, and wanted to have to, uh, tire minder on my rig, but, but, uh, just didn't, it, you know, I, I just, it was just a little bit out of my price range. And I'm assuming that obviously there's some guys that that's no big deal, but there's a lot of guys out there like, like me that were uh, still on a budget, you know, we're, we're still trying to make it. And, uh, and so 
I, I really appreciate that you've come on the scene now and are kind of bringing us some opportunities with Tire Minder and opportunities with saving fuel. And so I'd like to kind of just turn the turn the the uh, the, the mic over to you and allow you to kind of just express what you would express if if we were sitting right now at Tampa Bay uh, RV <laughs> show, <laughs> which I am in Florida, and you're in South Carolina, but uh, if we were sitting at a, at a at an RV show, this would be your presentation, mostly. <laughs> Is that right? <laughs> Mostly, but it, okay. actually, I go with the yellow. It's a lot quieter, so this is good. <laughs> That's good. So I'm going to jump into Tire Minder first. Let's start there. Okay, so Tire Minder is a brand that's been around for over 15 years. Tire pressure monitoring is very simple. Easiest way to understand it is you think about our personal vehicles. Our personal vehicles on our dash, it reads out our tire pressure. So if a tire goes low, we get the annoying yellow light, and it gives you a, a bell, and drives us all crazy, but you know, you got to go air up a tire. Well, it's the same thing. The difference is commercial vehicles. And, you know, Johnny and I talked a little bit about trucking. I, I had many large, you know, diesel trucks. Not a single one of them ever told me tire pressure. Never. Yeah. <laughs> they don't make it. And on some of these amazing new RVs that they're pushing out, and they're beautiful, they don't have it. It's right. not on there. So here's the reality, and I'll use my own RV as my example. I have a, I have a 40 foot, a um, little bit older diesel pusher, and it's got big tires and, and carries 100 psi in every one. But the reality is, if I blow a front tire doing 65 miles an hour, the results are not good. Okay. The, my, the end result of what will happen is not what I want. And because I travel with my wife, I don't ever want that to happen. Or if you blow a back tire, we've all seen or heard the stories about what a back tire, when it blows, not only is it dangerous, but the damage to the RV, to the inner workings, it's, it's horrible. Whether that's a, a fifth wheel, a trailer, a class C, class A, it doesn't matter. The story's the same. Yeah. So what TPMS does, it's a very small sensor, and this is it right here, okay? It's a very small sensor, and it, simply, and it simply threads on to the end of your valve stem. It weighs less than half an ounce. Wow. Fully set up, less than half an ounce. And when you thread it on, it electronically feeds back to a display. And, Johnny, I've got uh, the display that you had in your RV looks just like this. Yeah. Okay? The a and, it will read, <laughs> <laughs> and it will read that tire pressure and temperature back to that display every six seconds. Wow. And it happens automatically. So every six seconds, however many tires you have, whether it's four for a trailer, uh, 10, I think, Johnny, you had 12, uh, you know, whatever you have, it will display up to 20 tires at one time on the screens, and it will give you the tire pressure and temperature every six seconds. Now, I want to preface that by saying something really important. And as, as operators of trucks back in the day, you'll, you'll appreciate this. This monitor is not to be stared at nonstop. The idea is not for you to put this in your screen right up in front of your field of view so you're paying attention to it and looking at it all the time. This works in the background. You don't have to look at it all the time, okay? If for some reason, and we'll talk about that in a moment, it gave you an alert, you'll know. It gives you an audible sound oh. telling you there could be an issue. That way you can look at it. But it's always important. It's something that I always tell everybody, which is first and foremost, keep your eyes on the road. Keep the people in your RV and around your RV safe. Keep yes. your eyes on the road. Tire Minder is going to work in the background to keep you safe. So kind of going back to the purposing of Tire Minder, Back in the day, we were supposed to go out and stick every tire every morning to make sure it had proper tire pressure. If your tire's low, it can heat up and blow out, okay? If it's too high, when you get it warm, it'll blow out. So the idea is to keep your tire pressure where the manufacturer has recommended it. And that's really what this product is designed to do. So we don't have to crawl underneath and check them every morning, but when I get up in the morning and we're traveling, 
I simply turn my monitor on, it will very quickly attach all of the electronic signals from all my tires and read it to my display. Wow. These sensors read within one PSI of accuracy. They're the most accurate sensor on the market. And the idea is that I can quickly see in a glance all my tire pressures before I start. That way, if I see I've gotten a tire that went low, I need to find out why. Did I run over something? Is it a temperature issue? Did the RV sit too long? Could be a lot of things. But it gives me the alertness to check that. And then once we're rolling, I mean, we always look at the road, but who knows if we ran over a nail? You know, we've all experienced that. And if a tire drops three PSI in five seconds or more, it will instantly give us an alert, an audible alert. And wow. the idea for me is when I hear that alert, I want to pay attention quickly, move over to the side of the road to get safe. Okay. Yeah. My job is not to assess the monitor doing 65 miles an hour and try to figure out the problem. Right. My job is to realize we may have a problem. Let's slide over and get safe. Safe. Let's figure out what it is, and now we can address the problem. Because the goal of a TPMS system is to allow you to easily monitor both pressure and temperature. And we have a couple of systems that we do that with, but that's the focus point of this, okay? Mm -hmm. Being able to do that easily without any issues, flawlessly with amazing technology, that's the purpose of Tire Minder. So, so we do that through two main systems. That is our, I'll touch on both those, okay? Okay. <clears throat> so Johnny, um, he picked up what's called the I-10. The I-10 is a very small monitor. It's really cool. It displays up to 10 tires on a single screen or 20 tires on two screens. So you can monitor a ton of tires. And Super those, easy to install. Those screens go back and forth by themselves, so you don't have to flip they back. They do. Yeah. And, you know, I always say install is easy because I've done so many, but I remember asking you, how long did it take you to install it on your rig? I think you told me like 20 minutes. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think all set up, including the booster, maybe maybe 40 minutes with the booster. Okay. That's yep. awesome. Yeah. It was, so it was so easy. So for under an hour, you yeah. can set up an entire rig. The whole rig. And, and that's the I-10. Including, including my tow car. That was a, Oh, that was yeah. your tow car too. That included my tow car, yeah. Here's a really cool thing about the I-10. A lot of folks don't have the real big rigs, you know, and some have just a, a, a trailer or a fifth wheel with only four tires. Well, typically TPMS systems have been really expensive. Johnny has a discount code that he'll pass on, but the starting price for four sensors is only two forty nine. And then, Johnny, you've got a discount code. I'll let you share that at the video. But that will discount okay. even below that, which for a system like this is incredible. That's yeah, the price point that's I think tire minder hit a home run and kept going uh, to get a four sensor tire system for under 250 bucks. Wow. That's really that I didn't know that. I my I got twelve, so but that that's that's fantastic. So, you know, you, you buy the system based on how many sensors you need. And I, I think from the, you know, just the I-10 system for the money, for a color screen, what it does, it's awesome. Okay. Yeah. They have to step up from that and they call that the A18S. And it's a, I'll show it to you here. It's a little bigger monitor. <laughs> wow. Bigger yeah. Monitor. Yeah. But this, but this one does something really cool. It's almost like having two in one. Because not only do you get the bigger monitor and it displays all your tires and does all the thing the I-10 does, but this one will also simultaneously broadcast through Bluetooth to your cell phone or tablet. So like my wife, she has a, uh, an iPad that she uses when we're traveling. So she can monitor our tires wow. while I have the display. It's a little bit more money, you know, there's a little little more expensive due to the extra technology, but for those that want that piece where it uses their cell phone also, or they can have the display, it's brand new. Both of these are brand new for 2020. 
Um, the A1AS doesn't actually come out on Amazon or anything until May. So, and you have your viewers have access to this, Johnny, today. Wow. So, you're one of the very few pl places where if somebody wants one of these, they can get it uh, through your discount code today, where it's really not readily available yet. So, at these prices. That's really cool. And I know that with my I 10, you said that I had it in two days. I mean, it's it's crazy. And and what I understood is that the, with the discount code that I got that's available that I'll make available to anybody who watches this video um, is that it's less less money than you can find at any R like a uh, retail RV place. Um, I, I was doing some looking earlier today just to back that up. Your discount code provides a larger discount than anywhere else on the Internet as of today. Anywhere else. You cannot get this any cheaper than working through the full-time Freedom Tour channel. That's the wow. best place to get it. Awesome. That's, re that's really great. I'm grateful to pass that along. It's been a blessing to me, so that's really great. So what, what I'll say in closing about TPMS systems and – you know, and this is from an RV, okay? Yeah. Yes, I work with them, but whenever I do um, seminars and from a background in trucking, I'll be the first one to tell you this. I used to look at trucking and put features on them and say, wow, that's really expensive. Do we really need to buy that? Should we really have that? Until something bad happens. And then I go, I wish I would have had that. Yeah. Putting tires in, in, in the RV industry, I've learned this watching your channel. I remember your flat tire, actually. Yes, <laughs> and, yeah. and watching all the others, flat tires are expensive. The tow, the service call, the tire, even having access to one. And in not all cases, but in many cases, this can be prevented through not only preventative maintenance, through just simple monitoring. You know, if you've got an inner and an outer tire, Let's face it, we're not all checking the inner tire all the time. We're not, okay? And when that gets low, you don't know. The temperature heats up. You can't monitor temperature, and boom. And then everyone's asking, well, I don't understand why I blew that tire. It was brand new. And you what know? people talk about is the damage that that oh. can do. If it's the front tire, I mean, let's face it, we've seen all those videos, nightmare videos of, of oh, yeah. what a tire blowout can do. But what very few people talk about is when the rear tires blow up, not only can they take out off your siding of your coach, but they can get up inside of your coach and tear apart all the wires, all of the uh, like electronics and, and even plumbing. And it's, yep. a, it's a disaster. So I, I know for me, uh, TPMS has been something I have just, uh, been all about since day one. So what, what I'll leave it with on this is that if you're an RVer, whether you have a, a fifth wheel, a class A, class C, towable, um, a little micro one, you need to be seriously looking at TPM, TPMS mm -hmm. because you need to be able to watch those tires at all times. And here's the other one. If you have a tow car, yes. say everybody says, I got a camera, I can see it. No, you can't. <laughs> so good. No, you can't. I have a tow car and a camera and I can't see it. <laughs> I have seen so many photos of cars that have been just destroyed that they had no idea there was a flat tire. They're just dragging it. They're just dragging it down the road. My, I'll use my wife's saying. She always says to folks when we're at the trade show, she says, when the guy pulls up alongside of you and goes like this, He's not waving to you. No, <laughs> pull over. <laughs> There's a problem. Yeah. So, you know, if you have a tow car or a fifth wheel or a trailer where those tires are back there, you need to seriously invest in this. Yeah. Put it on your on your vehicle, on your trailer, on your coach, or on your car. It's the best investment you'll ever make into yeah. your safety and the people's safety around you to take care of you. And again, you don't have to stare at it 24 seven. That's not the idea. The idea is to let this work for you. And yeah. it's an investment into your safety. And it's always my hope that it never makes a sound for you. And it's always quiet. That's good. Because I know for me too, I, I, I it, in, a, in a weird way, it actually saves me money because on my tow car, I actually, because of that concern, I, 
I have run flats on my yeah. car and they're so expensive. Um, I mean, literally like sometimes they've been upwards of $250 per tire. Wow. And, uh, and, and I, and I, I keep like, man, why it's so ridiculous. I gotta, you know, have these run flats though. This tire minder on my run on my car does the same thing for me. It gives me peace of mind on my tow car. So I, 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 I am not going to put more run flats. And I know some guys will probably disagree with me, but that's an expense. <laughs> I'd, I'd rather have the, the TPMS system than the run flat. So the, the last item on tire minder is what yeah. I think is probably the coolest thing that tire minder ever came up with. Okay. This is, yeah. it's small, but I think it's huge inside each of the sensors. Okay. Each of these little sensors, there's a little battery. I'm sure you remember Johnny installing those batteries yeah. in your sensors. <laughs> Easy. Right? You can get these batteries at Walmart, Walgreens. You'll find them just about anywhere. They're between six and eight bucks per battery. Okay. Well, Tire Minder said anybody that buys a Tire Minder TPMS system, doesn't matter which one it is. Okay. Doesn't matter how many sensors it is. Once a year, you can go to the Tire Minder website. And in the upper right hand corner, you'll see a button that says battery program. And they will give you free batteries for as many sensors as you have. Because, of course, you're their customer. They'll look you up. They'll send you free batteries once a year. So you'll never have to buy batteries. Wow. And all you have to do is just call them up once a year. And you think about it. If you've got, like in my case, I have 10 sensors. It's like $70 a year in batteries that I'm getting for free. So in a matter of four years, I'm literally paying myself back for my entire investment into my TPMS system. And there's not another company out there that offers TPMS that does this with three year warranties on the products. I mean, come on, three years. That's amazing. It's, it's right. just amazing. So I, I'm proud to be affiliated with TireMinder. It was truly my pleasure to be able to work with you on this and, and get your reaction because it's key that you know, you're an independent and your voice carries a lot. So I, I love that. So on the tire minder stuff, work through Johnny and work through full-time freedom tour with his discount code and you'll get yourself flat out the most amazing system to help you just keep everybody safe. I love it. I appreciate it, Michael. And before I let you go, just talk really quickly. This is, this is as to me, just as exciting is, your discount uh, fuel program. Um, I I have it's, oh, it's it's only for diesel uh, RVs, if you will, diesel pushers. Um, but it actually, if, if if you're if you have a diesel pickup truck and you're pulling an RV, this you can be included in this as well. Um, it is. Uh, I, I I to be honest with you, when I first met you and you were talking to me about it. Uh, I talked to my wife about it and I'm like, that's too good to be true. I'm in it. I mean, I was like, mm. I just, even my wife was like, do you really know this guy? Do you trust him? And I'm like, we, we met on some, a totally different reason. And he's been very trustworthy. I, I, I just think that, that it really is a good deal out there. Tell me a little bit about it. So just like we talked earlier, the diesel program was really, brought out by my background where I've always used a fleet card and always had discounts because we had fleets of trucks. So we had these relationships. And when I sold that, I was left with just an RV. So I didn't get any discounts. And I thought, well, that's not fair. So I tried to reach out and get a discount. And they said, no, because we well, are just an RV or and you don't qualify. And I said, well, I use as much fuel as a truck on some days. So what we did is myself, uh, through my company, Innovation Energy, we went out and we facilitated what they call a master program. And we brought together discounts through over 1,500 truck stops across the United States. And as of today, our discounts range from as low as just 25 cents. So just 25 cents off a gallon. Just to 25. as much as I'm seeing reports, I saw it today, it was a dollar two off per gallon in Wisconsin. If anybody doubts me, I'll send you the paperwork on it. Oh. Up to a dollar two at a fuel station 
for our discounts. Um, we're typically seeing 40, 50 cents off a gallon every single day now when wow. these RVs are going in and filling up. But basically the program's super simple, okay? Uh, you can go to uh, our website and Johnny, you've got a link for this so they can work right through you again. And that's important, right. go right through Full-Time Freedom Tours channel and click the link. They can sign up. It does cost $10 to sign up for a card. And, and that's because we have to get you set up in our system. We've got to mail you out a card. There's a little postage in there. But to get you set up, it's 10 bucks. Once you get your card, you'll get a PIN number. And then anytime you go to fuel up, if you go to, uh, you know, a set where there's up in the Midwest, I think discounts today are almost 65 cents a gallon. And it doesn't matter if you fuel five gallons or you fuel 100 gallons. And this discount applies to anybody that has this card. And basically, you just set up a payment method with us, with our account. And when you fuel up the next business day, as Johnny, you can attest to, they'll charge that payment method. And you paid for your fuel and got your discount. So that the whole idea originally behind this was, I didn't want to pay full rate for fuel. But <laughs> I, I realized very quickly that I wasn't the only one that was frustrated with this. Yeah. Because the RV industry has been completely overlooked and I wanted to deliver uh, a semblance of savings. So this diesel fuel program for diesel fuel only, unfortunately, it's not gasoline, is whether you have a pickup truck, whether you have a truck, whether you have an RV diesel, class C diesel, it doesn't matter. If it's diesel fuel, you can sign up through Johnny's channel and you'll get a card sent out to you and a pin number. And as much or as little as you use it every year, it'll save you money. And I'm just telling you right now up front that I use this program extensively. We, we, uh, what I love about it, it's loves. You can use loves pickup, uh, loves truck stops, um, Petros. Um, uh, what is the. It's uh, Sap Brothers. Yeah. It's Sap, yeah. Sap Brothers. That's a good one. That I don't see a lot of Sap Brothers out there as much as loves is the one you see everywhere, but. Also, Petro and uh, it, it, unfortunately, it's not Pilot and Flying J yet. But right. uh, from what you're saying, that's still a work in progress. But there was another one that that well, yeah, we just brought on. I'll, I'll give you a little breaking news. How's that today? Okay, yeah, yeah. AM Best just delivered a huge discount for us starting this week, and AM Best is now part of our program. They will be rolled out onto the card. So if you have a card, you automatically get this. Wow. But 400 AM bests, we figure their average discount will be almost 70 cents. Wow. Is that the name of the truck stop? Is AM Best on the side AM of the road? Best, yeah. the name. Wow. Yep. That's it's called amazing. AM Based. And if you use our app, we have an app when you sign up with us. You can use it on your phone as yep. you're traveling. That app. Will, as you're looking in your route, you can look on that app and you'll see the fuel cost amounts in your route. So if you travel by, we'll pick on Flying J. They're not part of our program, so you'll see their fuel cost. But if you look across the street and you see a Loves or an AM Best or a Sap Brothers, you'll see that discount's way down. So you'll say, oh, I'll fuel up over there. Yeah. So this app can help you in your route to find that best fuel price. Yeah. That's part That's of this cool. program. I'm just telling you all, I have used, Gail and I use this. We love it. Um, I, I There's no strings attached. It's exactly what we're saying. It's a straight up deal. It's a no brainer. That's <laughs> that's the bottom line. I don't know what else to say. There's no tricks in their handbag. It's just a duh. And you should not be paying the price that you're paying for fuel. Uh, it's ten dollars for the setup. You get a card. The only thing is, you have to actually go through the fuel truck place. You can't use a little RV. Some like some of the Flying J's that we don't not even part of our program have those fuel islands. You have to go through the the uh, fuel the actual fuel setup, a uh, big truck setup places. So I appreciate you being on here so much today. I will put on the bottom of this video. I will put uh, the both both ways the where where to get the discount the website to go to our discount code and uh and and i think 
are they the same for the tire and the fuel or that's two different websites i can't remember um there are two different websites and i'll make you know i'll make sure that you have all the links and everything for everybody yeah but there's two different websites so they'll sign up for them separately but i just want to say thank you johnny for representing the community bringing this to everybody what you do on this channel is uh just amazing and i appreciate it personally for my education and i'm just pleased to be a part of it thank you well i'm grateful to have you on our team as well full-time freedom tour and just remember that that the whole point of this i started off this whole context of saying that while we're all at home and while we're all you know rvs are parked right now understanding that this too shall pass but um, I really, my heart when working with Michael was, you know, what can we offer uh, those of you that are, you know, you know, you're going to get back out there. Uh, you know, what can we offer as an incentive to say during this time, maybe, maybe now we can discount some of these things, fuel system, tire minder system, and maybe some other products coming out soon where we can discount them so much that, that it can help you while you're at home, kind of get set up and ready to hit the road again. So that's was the reason for me doing this video. And I appreciate you, Michael Kilburn, being on here. And uh, look, uh, just leave a comment below and let me know. Uh, uh, you know, I was thinking just a minute ago, you know, you got tire minder, you got fuel savings. What other kind of products out there would you like to see a discount on? Would you like to see uh, 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 maybe even a video made on and we can, we can, you know, kind of approach it that way and make some more videos about those kinds of things. So just want to say, God bless you. And thank you for joining us. Thank you again, Michael Kilburn. And we'll see you on our tour, full-time freedom tour. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.